You've got a cute way of talking. You've got the better of me. <laughs> Just snap my fingers and I'm walking. Hang it on. Do, 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 do. You ready to get started? Yeah, sure. Okay. Let me grab the book. Bonjour, Kakina Awia. Hello, everybody. And welcome back to the show. Welcome back to Buju Nana Buju, the podcast about Ojibwe language and culture. My name is Natasha. This over here, oh, be still my beating heart. <laughs> Get out of here. <laughs> this is Nana Buju. Ikadon Buju ni weenie mushane. Say hello, my sweetheart. <laughs> Hello, everybody. Welcome to the show. <laughs> and today, we're going to pick up where we left off yesterday. We've been reading Michael Lyons' book, um, Little Cutie, A Teddy Bear's Vision Quest. Little Cutie! It's a story of a a red and white teddy bear. And yesterday, when we left off, little cutie had run away from home. And he met a, um, who did he meet? A jitamu. Yeah, a jitamu, squirrel. That's squirrel in Ojibwe. A jitamu. And so when we left off, let me see here. There's a jitamu. As little cutie, or actually, sweetie, will, will you read the um, narration and I'll be little cutie. <laughs> okay. As little cutie approached the weathered gray-brown coop at the edge of the lawn, chicken voices erupted in protest. Get out! Get out! They screeched. It was Wagosh again. In a flurry of feathers and a flash of orange, the little fox shot out of the door and back under the wire fence where he had tunneled in earlier that morning. He paused next to little cutie to catch his breath. Ho ah, Wagosh said. Looks like we won't be having eggs for breakfast after all. Bakaakwe stood on the inside of the fenced-in area and glared at Wagosh. You stay away from my eggs, Wagosh. She snapped. Next time, I'll send you home with a black eye. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> she got her little, uh, her little foot is cl clutched in a uh, fist. Oh, I'm so scared, Baka Akwe, Wagosh replied with a sarcastic smile. Do you really think I'm too chicken to try again tomorrow? Baka Akwe's shiny black eyes narrowed and stared hard at the furry orange fox. Let's get out of here, little cutie, Wagosh said from the corner of his mouth. I think I may have gone too far with that last one. <laughs> <laughs> Soon the two friends were in the forest and out of sight of the house. Wagosh paused and said, Gee, it's nice to see you out here. What's the occasion? Actually, I'm on my way down to the lake. I've got to ask Migazi something. Migazi? Wagosh asked incredulously. Why do you want to talk to that guy? Little Cutie felt slightly self-conscious saying it out loud, but then answered, I'm going on a vision quest, and I need his advice. Ha! <laughs> that old blowhard doesn't know anything, Wagosh replied. Everybody thinks Migazi is so wise and spiritual and patriotic. He doesn't impress me. <laughs> well, Gosh isn't, isn't impressed with, with Migazi. What do you mean? Little Cutie was perplexed. 
He had never heard anyone say such things about the eagle. I'm telling you, he's just a figurehead, Wagosh said. The real brain of that operation is Mamengwa. Oh, wow. Uh, Mamengwa, butterfly. In a Joe boy. Mamengwa. Mamengwa, the butterfly? Little cutie asked. But I thought they were just good friends. I'm sure they are. But Mamengwa is smart enough to realize that nobody wants to hear all that spiritual mumbo jumbo from some old butterfly. <laughs> well, Gosh replied, Why do you want to go on a vision quest anyway? It's sort of complicated, he replied. I have to make some big decisions about my life. Little Cutie looked seriously into Wagosha's eyes and said, I think it may be time to leave the house. Oh, uh, <laughs> he's just sad. Yeah, Wagosha's explaining stuff to him. Got the explaining hand. Good, Wagosha explained. <laughs> no. no offense, but I'd sooner will live with the chickens. <laughs> it's not like that, Wagosh. I like living there. It's just that Aubrey's outgrown me. Really? Wagosh said. She doesn't seem like the type. Wagosh wrapped his arms around little cutie's shoulders and said sympathetically, Hey, don't take it too hard, Niji. They're only human, you know. <laughs> By the time they had arrived at Wagosha's hole, it was nearly noon. You want to come in for some lunch? Wagosha asked. We were going to have some eggs, but you saw how that turned out. Maybe the old lady can heat up some mac soup instead. <laughs> mac soup. Thanks anyway, but I don't really eat. You don't eat? No. Little cutie said. He was starting to feel self-conscious again. I don't actually have teeth or any of that. Oh, that's right, Wagosh suddenly remembered. Well, that's cool. You just want some coffee then? Um. Little cutie said. Just kidding. Listen, little cutie. Whatever you need for this vision quest, you just ask, okay? Wagosh said. I could care less about the humans or Megazi, but you're my Niji. There's nothing I wouldn't do for you. I know, little cutie said with a big smile. You're my Niji too, Wagosh. Okay then, Wagosh said. See you later. <laughs> what? Maybe that's a good place to stop. Yeah, okay. Well, there you go. Uh, let's call this, what is this, chapter two? Yep. Chapter two of um, Little Cutie, A Teddy Bear's Vision Quest by Michael Lyons, the rock star cartoonist. <laughs> no. Little Cutie. We'll pick it up again tomorrow. Um... Do you guys remember some of the Ojibwe? Let's, before we close out, these are the Ojibwe animal names we learned. There's what? Ajitamu? Yep. Squirrel. And Memengua, the butterfly. Mm hmm. Wagosh, the fox. Yep, Wagosh. And uh, who else? Migazi, the eagle. And Migazi. Migazi, eagle. All right, tune in tomorrow for chapter three of Michael Lyons' book, Little Cutie. Here, let me find the cover. Little Cutie, a teddy bear's vision quest by Michael Lyons. <laughs> All right, sweetie. Anything before we close out? No, that's good. <laughs> okay. Hey, everybody. Miigwech, Gabiz, and Dawiyeg. Thank you for listening. Uh, my name is Natasha. This is Nala Buju. Miigwech. And I will see you again. Gigawaba Min. Hey, 
give us a thumbs up if you like the show. And um, click the, uh, wherever it is, the um, subscribe button. <laughs> what? 